Radio. Finish me, oh. 
I see the wonders of your heart It's only you, only you that's keeping me Yeah, 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 yeah Oh, yeah Plenty, plenty, plenty uh, Plenty, plenty blessing for me Many, many, many uh, Many reasons to say I'm grateful And I love you And I don't take it for granted So I just want to say that I love you I really love you, Lord oh. Say that I need you I really need you, God Oh, oh yeah Plenty, plenty, plenty uh, Plenty, plenty blessing for me Many, many, many Many reasons to say I'm grateful. I'm grateful And I love you, I love you And all. I don't take it for mm -hmm. granted So I just want to say that I love you Oh, 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 God bless you guys. It is quite an honor once again to be on this show, you know, in your presence, joined with so many a one, wonderful, amazing people. As you guys know, this is the eighth episode of Flings to Rings, and we have something so special, something so exciting, something out of the ordinary. We have some people who are going to show you some things we have to display. We have so many things to actually eat you guys up with. So, yeah, man, it is amazing. Now, you know, before we get into it, today is going to be me and Jess, but it's going to be me and Jess with a difference. I promise you, there's some interesting things we got for you guys, and yeah, you're gonna love it. So, but let's just get it started. So, obviously, I'm your host, Chinon Zoyu Day. Once again, amazing to be in your presence. It's Monday, the 15th of April. I don't know why I said the date, but you know, <laughs> it is Monday, right? You've beat Mondays. Hopefully, this will be another way of opportunity for you guys to actually start your week in such a positive note, you know, hearing a couple of love stories and stuff like that. So, we got something pattern for you something special for you guys but the only problem that we see first we have five likes we have 37 concurrent viewers we want more likes right because you know the way the algorithm works the more you like the more people see the more they like the more people see and before you know this message that we're speaking is spread to many 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 peoples so we want you guys to jump on be a part of this bandwagon as we're you know trying to expand and spread the words which we're speaking if that makes sense so cool without further ado obviously we have jessica i do say it is a special show so don't worry that it's just me and jessica because it actually is not just me and Jess, but yeah. Just introduce yourself. You introduced me already, but anyway. Yeah, <laughs> guys, obviously we are back as JB. Come on. Um, We are here obviously with another episode of Flings Two Rings, as mm -hmm. Chinna said. Now, tonight we're going to have a very special announcement at the end. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah, obviously I'm not going to ruin it now. Mm. We're going to save it till the end. But guys, literally look out for that. And then also um, share the link out and get everybody involved. We're mm. literally going to go through some stuff today. But quickly, yeah, yeah, before we get into anything. Chin. Yo. You know there's this whole thing of like love languages, yeah? Okay. Do you know what that is? Yes, I do. <laughs> what's, what's love language? So I think from my knowledge of love language, and I pray that she's not going to ask me what my love language is, right? <laughs> just in case, just to, yeah. If you already know that question's coming, it, though. It's not coming. You already know that question's <laughs> well, coming. I'm going to avoid and dodge it. But essentially, where is um, love language? So from the little I know, I believe that certain people, individuals, have a sense of um, the way that they want to be loved. I know certain people is money. They want to just be... They all meant someone to spread money on them. And to me, I used to think that was so selfish. But when you actually have conversations with certain people, that's literally what they want. If you give them money, they love it. Other people's time. So essentially, I'll say love language is the way in which an individual desires to be loved. Am I correct? Yes, I am, right? 
Exactly. Mm. I, took, I took the definition out of her mouth. She wanted to so correct me, but those that know what love language is, please let us know. And also, if you want to share what your love language is, please do so. <laughs> Chin said his love language yeah, mm-hmm. is yeah. Chin, what's your love language? I'm a bit seriously, on, <laughs> so, on a so serious what, note. So, what are the options? What, what's, what's okay? So, let me get. Oh, hold on, one second. Because you know, obviously, you know. Yeah. <clears throat> okay. So, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> So love languages um, is basically, it describes different ways people express and experience love. Understanding Mm. your partner's love language Mm. can greatly improve communication and strengthen your relationship. Yeah. So there's five types. Yeah. There is words of affirmation. Okay. Acts of service. Mm. Receiving gifts. Chai. Quality time. Mm. And physical touch. Interesting. (laughs) It's tough. Because what's the first one? So the first and one... And you need to hit me quick with them. What's the first one? Words of affirmation. A woman who knows how to speak words of conviction in prayer. That's my prayer. Hit oh. me. What's the next one? What's the, what's, what's, hit me with the, So words of conviction, right? Hit, next, hit me. Hit me. Hit okay. Me. Acts of service. Someone who can serve. A woman who is a ministry. <laughs> You know, when I see a woman ministry, gift. oh, gift of the Holy Spirit. <laughs> I, I, me, don't test me, right? Quality time. Someone leave me at the altar <laughs> with my father. Oh, my, 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 my. Physical touch. This is someone who has touched the, the, the horns of the altar. My, my, my guy, let me tell you. And yeah, that's just me. I mean, I'm giving too much, in fact. I'm giving too much away, right? But Jin, as for me, what's I'm it called? Of- you see, it's like, it's like asking someone, what's your favorite book in the back? Oh, there's so many. I there, I, there's too much, man. Jin, you are banned. N- narrow from one today, down, oh, there's too much, man. From today, Come you on. are banned. Damn, like, like, I, don't, I, I don't know. It's just. <laughs> you're yeah. banned. You're absolutely you banned. Have, give me one and then let's work on that book. In fact. All right, cool. <laughs> okay, let's start. <laughs> you know? Words of affirmation, yeah? Mm, okay. So, that mm. one. Wow. Okay. Why I take that very important, right? It's because words of affirmation, you want, when you're there, broken and sad, you want a woman that can pray. Mm-hmm. speak words of affirmation into mm-hmm. your life you know right. stir up things mm-hmm. in your spirit what's next <coughs> yeah, yeah that's so acts of service hmm. so you know this this is like in relation to no 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 no. i'm telling i'm telling you what's in relation to <laughs> okay. a woman have you seen a woman okay have you okay okay mm-hmm. you wanna okay <laughs> <laughs> so have you ever seen a guy serving in the house of god what does that do to you just tell me i said rog Glory to God. And you don't like acts of service. <laughs> no, nah, move. Me, me, me Chin, me. it's not even. It's not even on that kind of level. Who said that? Who? who? That's a world. Is a. That's is, a weird. Is the Chin, matrix, you're weird, is, bro. Is the, is the worldly so, thinking. So, so when you see, you know, your wife to be yeah. serving God. Oh, stop it! Stop it! You're making me see things like, oh, no, 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 stop, stop. <laughs> there, it's cool. It's cool. I'm blushing. I'm red. Listen. I'm blushing. <laughs> I'm blushing. Well, now we know, innit? It's now well, we yeah, know. Yeah, yeah. Now we absolutely know. Mm. So, <laughs> so and it, and it, to okay. be honest, yeah. So Chin has basically holified this this whole thing. Mm, mm, yeah. Mm-hmm. Chin has holified everything. My bad. But um <clears throat> to mm. those who are real, yeah, mm. and really know what words of affirmation um is. Surprising. <laughs> Someone's telling me I'm too so, spiritual in church. Okay, I'm sorry. Nobody said I'm, that. Nobody said that. that. Nobody holy, said that. I'm holizing everything. Love is hope. Uh, in fact, don't even go there. You, don't you, even you, start. You know when they don't say that. Don't start with fact, that, man. You no know Wednesday. When you know the, the minute the, when you feel it's time for you feet to preach on a Wednesday. Trust me, I'll say the mysteries behind love languages. My goodness. And the significance in songs. Of My us. good God. Uh, yeah. you guys, hey, you guys haven't we're paid in trouble. Yet. You guys haven't paid we're in trouble. So I'm not gonna go there. In fact, guys, did you well. did you see that? Did you hear that? Did you, mm, did, my is, goodness, well. that day because. That day you saw us, you saw they were so sweet. They, were, they must say, if I'm releasing that one, that one, yeah. That mystery. That mystery. I don't think they're man. ready for it. They're not, they're not, they're not. They're not ready for it. They're not ready for it. All right, cool. So, guys, honestly, the true, the, the true, real, real, real meaning of like words of affirmation, right? Yeah. So, it's um, verbal expressions mm. of love and appreciation. Mm. Not, you know, somebody calling your name out in prayer mm. like what Chin wants at the mm. altar. Mm, mm. Um, so yeah so I don't know some people obviously like when they say you know I love you and stuff like that and I can mm. see some of the couples I've been on the show are already um, commenting so guys if you want to share which ones um, you guys sort of use or like or mm. um, is your pref- uh, preferred language then that would be good and then acts of service yeah, people who actually 
Um, so people whose love language is acts of service feel mm. loved when their partner helps them or does things to make their life easier. Mm. Not serving in the house of God. No, wait, wait. wait why, why Don't holy fire it, man. No, no, no. No. Because remember, what's it? What's the verse? Judgment will begin where? In the house of the Lord. Did so I, what, I, what, I, what, what does that have to do with... What does that have to do with words of affirmation? Anyways, 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 carry on, carry on. <laughs> okay, cool. And then receiving gifts. Mm. So if someone's put money bags. Mm, yeah, I can see. I can see. Yeah, there's people who love money here. You know. They're, they're Somebody, someone hands me an envelope. Mm, that's mm. that's that's Quessies. Mm, <laughs> mm. <laughs> okay, cool. And then quality time. People mm. spending time together with one another, not spending time at the altar, as Chin has holy fight it to be. Sorry. Sorry. Move, man. Let me finish sorry. this. Sorry for being in scripture today. I'm sorry. And then physical touch, we'll leave that because I'll, I'll think mm. that'll probably be relative to the married people. If if so, <laughs> if you're quality terms, and that's even a discussion, but we're not gonna go there. What physical touch? Yeah, I forget. Yeah, <laughs> Let's that has to be for married people. You yeah, can't. It must be. It must be. Cool. Uh, as well. Um, actually, no, well, it says. Mm, mm, mm. Well, no, I will not be encouraging any. So whichever one, whichever physical mm. touch people want to stay at, let that let that be your so level. Someone said holding that's not, hands. Yeah, that's in it. it's on there. Okay, cool. Do you not hold hands, Chin? Or you do you pray in hands? You don't. You don't hold hands. <laughs> that's too. Show me a place where it says they they held hands. Mm. I see lay hands. I've never seen <laughs> hold hands. Mate, I, guys, Chin. I'm about myself in this. Chin. I, Okay. Jin, I'm, you nah. are banned. You see, th- maybe yeah, you well. are banned. But, you <laughs> are banned. Uh, guys, you, am I alone in this? You know what? Show me a place where he held or she I held his hand. Like, I've seen lay hands. You know what, yeah, Chin? They need to get you like I feel like when you get to marital class, they're gonna have to separate you to a whole <laughs> different class by yourself because <laughs> you need help. <laughs> you need deliverance, my guy. What, deliverance from what? No, no, tell me what. what do I, no, no, I need said, a, deliverance from what? Man? Lay hands. Lay, yeah, lay. like you, as well. Lay, deliverance from what? No, no, tell me. You said I need deliverance. Tell me what I need deliverance from. Shit. As well, man. Nah, today I don't know. You're on one. You're well. absolutely on one. Mm. Okay, cool. Well, guys, um, unfortunately, but fortunately, mm. this will be the last show of Flings to Rings. It's definitely um, not for me, dog. You see, people want it, so I'm sad for that as well. Now, I think I think we've had enough. Mm. I think people have had enough. Mm. I think we're all on a. We've all had a, a decent dose mm. of of love. I'm seeing some of the comments here. Okay. Paul said, do not hands. be quick to lay Chin hands. Chinese marital uni. Please, people have witnessed different, my guy. Samson laid his hands, he laid his head in the laps of the lad. Like, uh-huh. Okay. Paul <laughs> said, do not be quick to lay hands. Man. It's true. It's, there's two points there, right? Chin. It, what, what? I hope what? you're taking notes. I'm taking notes. I hope you're taking notes. As well. I, I'm, I'm learning. Okay, yeah, no. So anyway, yeah, so we've had enough. Well, I think we've probably had a decent dose of all this love talk mm. and um yeah today will be the last um show yeah. of the series mm. however we have an announcement at the end but um quickly we just want to recap and go through some of the highlights of um of what we've discussed throughout this this whole um series and we'll be showing little clips of some of our um Couples that have come on mm. and some of the things that they've said. <laughs> mm. So we'll, we'll just quickly recap, Chin. Yeah, cool. So to start from there, you know, we understand that when we started this Flings to Rings series, right, we tried to document, you know, to some degree, the progression from, you know, being in Flings or being in just a relationship to actually marriage. You know, certain people had different struggles at different phases. We tried mm. to showcase that. And by the grace of the living God, you know, we wanted to say thank you. Thank you to every single person that participated. Guys, you guys literally piloted the show along with every guest on the show. We had some amazing guests. We had some guests who were, you know, were interesting. <coughs> say interesting. Some guests who said a lot which were just like wow and we're gonna see a couple embarrassing clips and i'm happy because some of them are actually here then we had guests who actually shared some deep things and every single one of you who came on we appreciate you we actually love you guys and we just wanted to say thank you so kicking off because i've spoken too much right we are gonna get straight into it so cool who remembers clip, this clip number one yeah who remembers who this, remembers this? Cool. like cool let's see you feel like you've lost hope you may not ever find the one the again one. Mm. oh 
I know the one is coming. Hey, I know like that. I know my name. The one is coming. Come on, come on, come on guys. Are you me in spirit? On top are you third? I cannot oh, yeah. serve God. And you put me to shame. Come on. I love it. I love it. I love it. Have you seen me? Let me be so afraid of this. 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 Let me be why I find that so amazing is because that sense of confidence, mm, man. Amen. In God. Because is, is, I know, obviously, we're joking, we're laughing. But at the same time, trust me, I think one of the biggest causes of anxiety yeah. sometimes is, you know, when you're looking for a spouse, you want yeah. somebody, but you can't seem to find the person. It keeps it keeps like you keep missing them. And that's why I praise <coughs> God for Sister Yvonne. You showed so much, you know, so much trust and faith in the Most High God that, look, it doesn't matter. And why it doesn't matter? Because I know who I am. So you're not mm. saying because of, look, this factor, that factor is an internal factor. And that's amazing to see. What do you think of that, Jess? Amen. No, honestly, yeah. Shout out to you, Yvonne. Honestly, mm. that was a great, great, great addition to the show. Mm. Um, I remember that was like, what, the first episode mm. um, as well. So she came with fire. She really mm. came to deliver. And um, I really, really do like Yvonne's story. She's actually been through quite a few bits. Mm. And um, she still has that confidence and strength in God. So honestly, guys, do not give up. If you're singles out there looking mm. for you know, the one, as they'll mm, say. Yeah. Um, yeah, don't give up. God is mm. God is coming through. He's, He's coming. coming through. In the name of Jesus, he is. And <laughs> the next clip we have to show you is when it comes to taste, I realise that some of the people who we've actually invited on the show actually have taste. Yes. Ooh. Uh, there I say, some people have, tooth. yeah, yep. Some people have <laughs> a specific <laughs> type. Type. You know, so uh, Yvonne didn't really give hers, mm. but, there were some people who were bold enough to let us know their type. And watch out for this. <laughs> yeah. Mm. Okay. And care to fill us in? Oh, yeah. Um, oh, yeah. Okay. Uh, <laughs> should I? Okay. I like a black man. Hey. 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 I like my bros, my brothers. Hey. Give, me, give me fire. Give me fire. Hey. Give me fire, bro. Hey. Give me fire. I'm still in shock. They are the best. <laughs> in, in fact, Let's forget I asked that question. Let, yeah, okay. Moving on. In fact, time. Time. Yeah, time. Yeah, time. Mom, you like what? You, you asked me quite a bit. I like the B L C K black black okay, man. Cool. African. Oh yes, African, African black, black man. Okay, cool. Um, remember, there's 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 young people watching, right? It's so cool. Oh, no, I don't like the young ones. Sorry. I do like black men that are my age or older than me. Mom, trust um, me. I believe. After you said, I believe you. Trust okay, me. Okay, trust okay. Me. Let's, let's not go any further than that, please. <laughs> You know what? I feel like that's something I will never ever forget. I cannot forget that moment. You know, the way she spelled the black B L A C K black man. I'm scared. <laughs> you know, Chin is still scared. I, 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 you know, it, in that video, Chin said, I'm still in shock. <laughs> just, you know, it's because obviously what I was expecting, I'm, well, Chis, one thing, Chis, I, 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 I praise God for mom because mom is like, she's, she's, she's real, right? She wasn't doing guy. Some people say, oh, I want someone who's a prayer warrior. We know we love, yeah. But she said straight, B-L-A-C-K. As she was saying it, I said, I spelt it. Then I was like, what? I was like, oh, I was like, oh, okay. <laughs> no, yeah. that, that is definitely a memorable show. As I mean, a well. memorable yeah, show and, mm. and time as well. Mm. I absolutely love that clip. That's mm. probably like one of my favorite ones. That, I'm not going to lie to you. It's one of the that highlights. black man. Mm. Oh gosh, you know what, Mamatina? May God give you that black man in Jesus' name. <laughs> like... <laughs> I'm not even trying to may say you amen. Be I won't grace. Lie to you. <laughs> may amen. you be graced with this black man. Yeah. You, amen. You pray that prayer, innit? Like, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 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 No. So, Do you not want that for Mama Tina? Want what? Do you not want God to grant her heart's desire? With a man of God, yes. <laughs> okay. Okay, a black man of God. <laughs> next clip. Let's let's go, let's go to the next clip because a black man of God. <laughs> no, it's just it's it's well, man. Ah, right, cool. But amen. okay, amen. Cool. So moving on swiftly to on. the next cool. clip. So for the next clip, we had um, some wisdom, you know, that was given to us, right, in regards to submission. When does submission start? When should you actually? What should you do with it? And yeah, I found this quite insightful. So we're going to listen to it. Act like it's gone stone cold yet. Yeah. Let's say you guys are in the car, scene okay, set, wrong clip, you know, yeah. had a nice romantic date, all that stuff. Actually, you feel a bit handsy. One of you's feeling a bit touchy touchy. Okay, cool. So I'm actually gonna go I'm actually gonna go back, right? So wrong clip. 
But essentially, yeah, this clip was quite interesting. Why I say this clip was quite interesting because long story short, we had a conversation and we found certain mysteries and, you know, things on how to avoid touchy, weird situations. You guys understand what I'm trying to say, right? (laughs) So we're going to play it and it's going to be interesting. So guys, hope you guys enjoy it. Act like it's gone stone cold, yeah. Let's say you guys are in a car, scene set, you know, had a nice romantic date, all that stuff. And mm. you feel a bit handsy. One of you's feeling a bit touchy touchy. What do you man do at that point? I'm I'm not gonna lie and say like it's it's rosy posy. It's not easy. Mm. Um at the end of the day we're human. We have feelings, we have emotions, we have you body not if I would. Yeah. I hear you, you know? Danny. Mm, but that's, that's um true. I'm yeah. <laughs> 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 But um yeah that um like no sleepovers mm. um mm. you know mm. and, and like you were saying if by the grace of God usually one of us is the stronger one so Amen. if one of us is feeling all right you know you need to stop that or I don't know maybe sometimes it might be she might say something she might say something which is like church related literally just ma- just tip. mention something you learned in church just <laughs> yeah. and literally <laughs> everything just off. i'm not i'm not, not getting so wait you're saying so mid moment so so, so, no, 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 wait, wait. so let's say for example let me set the scene you haven't seen each other for a long time you're just together thugs, bro. you're cuddling you know you're beautiful then there's a kiss there's a kiss and <laughs> then you remember <laughs> sunday service is that what you're telling me <laughs> you remember something my god <laughs> like, hey you know when prophet said this what did you think of that believe like, me everything was just turn turn off, off, turn off. Off. how awkward is that no, you've, you've ruined the mood <laughs> <laughs> So yeah, you know what? Nigel's face was sad. If, not, if you look at the clip here, I want to replay it because you I see like the, Nigel you, looks like he has some battle scars, man. Like, nah, he's, he's been through some stuff. Like he's really, like, really had nah, to firm some things. Because so just imagine. Oh no, let me, it's, it's, <laughs> I feel like I feel like from that I can sense what you lot's um, love language is. Okay, cool. In fact, let's not I call feel like from that I can sense what the love language is over going there. there. Oh, move, we're man. Not, not going there. <laughs> I feel like you probably sense Marriage what it is over there. Now you're annoying. She's about so, to look in this move. Book. So nah. anyway, but do you know what? Do you know that that video? Yeah, honestly, um, more power to you guys. I hope um, the story is getting stronger, mm. um, and you have more examples for us as to how you can, you know, bamboozle those moments because those moments we. Probably very serious mm. if it's getting too heated. And then, oh, we should have brought the heavens and the herbs. Mm. Oh, that, I forgot that about one. that one. That, that one. The heavens and the herbs. Do, do you know what it is, yeah? So, okay, for those who don't know, <laughs> this was a, it was a deep conversation, right? Couple being vulnerable, open in front of everyone. And so we're having this conversation now and we're speaking and they're speaking about the personal things that happened and how they overcame. And Nigel now says, yeah, like sometimes I do, you know, take her here and there. So Danny is looking and then she realizes then she looks at Nigel and if you guys saw what we saw in the studio <laughs> if you saw the way it's like I don't know if she wanted to grab him <laughs> ask Nigel how your wrist <laughs> Oh, Nigel, how's your, how's oh your, my gosh, no, that was a was, good moment. That nah, was funny. It was, it was interesting. That was so funny. You know. But yeah, guys, honestly, I hope you guys enjoyed Danny and Nigel's um show. At like um always I keep doing. Yeah, always a pleasure to to have you guys on. It was a very, very good talk. Honestly, all the shows are still up so mm. if you want to catch any one of them you're more than welcome to go back and catch it and you you'll catch all the clips like literally the whole video is not going to be snippets of it you catch the whole clip so please do visit that if you want some if you're dating or in a relationship and you want it to be a godly one or you're looking to enter into a godly relationship they have some serious nuggets in there so yeah it'll be good for you to visit but yeah mm. next one cool so the next clip is quite interesting right this so, one yeah <laughs> this one, this one, <laughs> this one i feel like it was a battle for me okay. like this one was a battle mm, 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 this one mm. was a battle anyway you you see mm. what i mean chin go ahead so right speaking about the mysteries and the myths and breaking and decoding all this thing about <clears throat> submission we're going mm. to see something amazing right so <laughs> it's going to be a short one but it's quite insightful one it's actually something i actually learned quite a lot from Right? We're going so to discuss cool. this after. We're going to definitely discuss okay, this. Without on. further ado, presenting to you, 
the couple. In not, essence, not them. So you believe that <laughs> yeah, yeah, submission yeah. is um something that should be demonstrated and seen as you're going in the, as as you're caught in. Yes, cool. Yes, but at that. the same time, I wouldn't say fully because mm. you can't again you can't submit to your boyfriend yeah. to submit to your fiance yeah doesn't make any sense there's no covenant you don't mm. owe the guy anything yeah yeah however you are putting yourself in a favorable position mm. you demonstrate your suitability yeah i found that very interesting <laughs> why do you find that interesting chin because <laughs> there's a there's a certain you know when they say oh, yeah, so one of my love languages is a word <laughs> there's, submission. A, there's a word that's alone i'm joking i'm playing, I'm playing. one fact, of your love languages no, is no, no, submission let, let me even break that down but because you read the pe- way people are hounding me pe- the way the looks people have been giving me since that day good no not good it's not good. it's not good it's not good <laughs> guys i believe no, let, 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 let me not even speak in it but cool i found that very interesting because genuinely speaking is like cool as a woman who wants to you're dating somebody how do you show submission are you even meant to show submission and it was something interesting he said he's like cool show him a little bit that you have the potential to but don't definitely go don't don't even go there like show them that you can but cool so Bam, Chin, you have to do what definitely. is your stance on submission now submission what's my what do you mean <clears throat> now I, like it's meant to have changed ah what? so it's still the same well okay okay <laughs> so Chin, all the eight shows that we've had mm. you still have that mindset it's only cemented and solidified what it means to be in a loving passionate intimate <laughs> caring marriage where submission reigns <laughs> <laughs> i'm joking guys i made that one on the spot Jesus. <laughs> if it works i mean if it makes sense it makes sense yeah you know take it or leave it but <laughs> oh no no well. no it makes sense right isn't it it, it makes sense right no so, <laughs> you know Chin. well cool um, I- I'm work, done with we're, you. We're working on from it. today. We're, we're working on I'm it. washing my hands off. <laughs> it's all, it's, I can't save you, bro. It's, it's, like it's, this is actually dark. No, 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 no. But it's, this is over. <laughs> it's over. Now nah, you know it is. You it's, think, yeah, that mm. throughout this whole time you would have learned something. And I, I know from what even Colin gave the words of wisdom, mm. what minister came and shared with us. Mm. All of that didn't enter. Because sometimes learning is much deeper than adding knowledge. Sometimes learning is also finding the solidification of the knowledge. Be quiet, be quiet. See, this, this be is, quiet. Yeah, there's higher be wisdom quiet. being shared here. Be quiet, oh, man, be quiet. I should be in Cambridge sharing this thing. <laughs> I'm sharing it with you. Oh, it's bad. Let me, no. I'm, I'm, I'm getting hot. <laughs> you guys can see I'm getting hot. It's well, hey, it's well man. The cool. show's done, man. <laughs> it's cool. Oh, all, all that. <laughs> nah. It's cool. Thank you, Sean. <laughs> you see, only my brothers. We're the real brothers. Guys, if you're a brother, I just want to see your thumbs up. <laughs> exactly. No. My real brothers. Guys, don't entertain Chin <laughs> submission <laughs> talk. Do not entertain Chin submission <laughs> talk. Do not. Nah. <laughs> but no, okay, so... <laughs> Um, honestly, guys, we really want you to think about what submission actually means when dating. Because mm. I feel like some people said, obviously, some people are doing too much mm. where they're literally acting like wives when mm. they're not wives yet. And then some people are saying you don't necessarily need to do anything mm. and that they haven't put a ring on it. So why should I behave or even attempt to submit? So all mm. of that is there. So again, if obviously you're in a godly relationship or seeking one, that would be one thing that I think you should definitely take on board because um, listening to somebody like Chin, mm. <laughs> I don't mm. know. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Don't listen to Chin. Speak to maybe a leader or something about that to get specific clarity um, on it because Chin, mm-mm. You know, and it's, it's well, as well. You know, <laughs> there's a spirit of the age that we're fighting. This thing called feminism, but as well. What spirit <laughs> of feminism? This is nothing to do with feminism, yeah. bro. Did I, did I say, don't did bring did that here. Don't bring that here. You put words in my mouth. I said Don't fem. bring you, that you here. You put words in my mouth. <laughs> cool, Chin. Bro. Cool. As well. Brother Bruce, my, my brother. Cool. So the next. Bruce. Thing, <laughs> Bruce. Uh, as well. That's my brother, man. He's Bruce, speaking you of truth. all people. He's speaking truth, man. So right, cool. cool. The next clip that we have, right, is of a certain couple and you know, they actually are in the engaged stage. Quite a beautiful union, right? And they gave us some tips or things that have kind of changed their mindset on this thing called temptation. Because temptation is a real thing, but you know, certain understanding was given to them through certain experiences and bam, things have changed. And I'm speaking too much, so I'll let you guys see for yourself. So next clip. So, loaded. we've been doing this whole walk of purity by the mm. grace of God, yeah? Mm. Now, God said, obviously, abstain until marriage by the grace of God. Amen. Now, I'm thinking, okay, cool, you know, you put the ring on it, yeah? Mm. So, we're close to the finish line. We're planning the wedding. Basically, that now, in about six months, eight months, we're going to mm. be married, yeah? yeah? We're going to sleep in the same bed. We're going to be doing what married people do. Yeah. Since I'm so <laughs> sure and certain that this is actually going to happen, mm. why not just start now? Mm. Yeah. Mm. Have you thought about that? 
Um, I think the urges have increased, definitely on my side. Anyway, um, we'll see as like dry fasting. Mm. You have the mentality they're going to start dry fasting. You love Jess, mm. but then the hunger Why still comes. Eat? Like you're not going to say I'm going dry. And then your belly doesn't rumble. Yeah, so that's yeah. how I feel, kind of. So mm. I, I know I wouldn't go into it, mm. especially when we're that close into to getting married. Yeah. But the urges are there. Yeah. Like you see her as yours, basically. Yeah. Like yeah. you've already got the receipt that okay, I'm gonna buy this. Now it's just mm. going to the shop to exchange it. But mm. Mm. I'm just you just have to wait and stay subtle until that time comes. Mm -mm. And mm. It, it's true. I think I agree with Sean that for me, yes, it is Sean. slightly harder now that like the finish line is almost there, like you said. Mm. But at the same time, it's like, mm, it's not actually that hard at times. Mm. I think it's depending on like situation and stuff. But for example, like obviously Sean got baptized um, mm. end of last year. Yeah. yeah. God. Hallelujah. Amen, um, man. And Amen. I think for me, it's like, I see him in a completely different light mm. like bro they don't when they talk about that water that anointing that you mm. get when you come out the water bro. like it's very evident and i see it in him now amen, so amen. Me, amen. Like, i can't we can't fall because i can't jeopardize yeah, like, yeah. that anointing. Amen. Like, i'm not, not gonna be it. responsible amen. for yeah. messing this thing exactly. up yeah. 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 Like, yeah. cannot be responsible for that so that's what's sort of keeping me going knowing that mm. you know mm. it is it is what it is it will be worth the wait amen, amen. so yeah mm. i like that answer yeah amen yeah, amazing answer. I genuinely enjoyed and loved that answer because when you actually come to think about it, it's actually so true. You know, sometimes I think when you go through certain things as a couple, right, and you actually see, wow, and this is, I think, the beauty of what it means to genuinely be true and mm -hmm. when you're going through a conversion process. Mm -hmm. Because imagine mm -hmm. you said to someone, I'm saved, I'm mm -hmm. saved now. So, you know, yeah, I don't want to be doing A, B, C, and D. But then you're, you're still doing the A, B, C, yeah. and D. They might just say, yeah, yeah, whatever. But in the instance where you actually see, rah, someone's changing. This woman is now blossoming. This man is now becoming serious. It's like, I do not want to mess what you and God have. Amen. And because of that, I'm not even going to try that kind of Amen. thing. So I found that such an interesting example. So no, trendy, trendy, that was amazing. Sean O, 007, beautiful stuff, man. <laughs> 007, you know. Oh that guy was gosh, cheeky. He's Your a show James was Bond. Cheeky. The guy was cheeky throughout fully, the show. You fully, know. <laughs> fully. But no, honestly, I yeah. agree with that one. Because imagine having somebody who's not on the same page as you. Mm. You're trying to rise and they're trying to do touchy, touchy. You're trying to do <laughs> this and they're trying to, do you know what I'm saying? Like... You know, but then Chin, I actually blame you, yeah, because that analogy of the whole um, dry fasting, yeah. comparing it to sleepovers and stuff, yeah. I blame you. You right. holified everything so much that people like <laughs> Sean are now trying to copy you. Wait, so was, was the man wrong? No, I liked his analogy. You you take was, it too was, far. Was the man you, wrong? You take it too far. Because if you learn fasting, How you How can you say not holding hands, but laying hands? I don't understand you. Was, okay, cool. I'm giving a challenge. <laughs> One verse. And she's looking at me. She's looking at me. I'm looking at you. I'm as looking well. at you as well. Exactly, JB. Don't hate the game. Hate the player. All right. <laughs> I don't know what if that matches. you guys say, man? So finally, the last clip that we have now. So we had a married couple on a quite unique married couple in the way they presented themselves. One thing I really cherished was having calling and wisdom on mm. as they came with the wisdom, the expertise, right? you actually realise that there was a sense of genuine love and a bond that they have. Mm. And normally from single people, we normally think of it like, you know, you love each other whilst you're dating and courting, but when you're married, it just gets, it's all about kids and paying bills. But to see the names that they were calling each other, Colin is like he was playing his guitar afresh and new again as mm. he looked into the wonderful eyes of wisdom and as they spoke up. I'm, about, I'm doing poetry. Yep. But without further ado, right, what we're going to do, we're going to show you guys the clip. So cool. This is advice about what it means to actually submit or one of the biggest things you need to actually know getting into a relationship. Let's go. What advice, Colin, would you give to women looking to go into marriage, a godly marriage? And then, Wiz, what would your advice be for men looking to go into a marriage? I think like what I said for myself. So as a woman, I think you need to learn how to submit to God initially. Mm. Then I think it will create then the passageway, so the right way for you to be able to submit to your husband. Okay. And learning to truly like find in yourself basically. Mm. That, mm. that means many things, but. Amen. Yeah, sure. oh, thank you. Yeah. Amen. And Wiz? Yeah, me to the men. Um, uh, stability, know who you are, who your okay, goals, yeah. set it straight. Yeah. So when you bring someone in, you build something beautiful together. Mm. Clear your field, like Prophet has said, and bring your wife in. 
in stability, in strength, in mm. unity. Mm. Yeah, that's all I have to say. They were deep, innit? it? Those Honestly. guys were so deep. Do you get me? And it's so true. It's and like, I haven't even married for that long. But then the wisdom that's mm-hmm. been birthed. When you marry <laughs> the wisdom, wisdom, the wisdom. When you marry wisdom, you can only produce wisdom. Jin, why why, do, you to, me, why do you always have to do that? Oh, is what I'm saying a lie? <laughs> Fam, stop fighting truth, man. Why, 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 why? Well, man. But honestly, it's actually really genuinely powerful stuff. And we praise God for that, you know. And I think it's so amazing because, you know, just looking at the relationship, I remember going to the wedding. It was a beautiful wedding. Mm. I, I felt so, Ooh, it was so yes. solemn. I, I was yes. just like, wow. And seeing, and I think that's yes. the beauty of community. You see couples grow from, you know, boyfriend and girlfriend to, you know, people who are mothers and fathers taking care of homes and families. Amen. And it's beautiful to look, to watch, to track, and to also gain advice from. So that's why I say my brothers and my sisters, we've just shown a sample, right? A sample of the amazing couples that we have here at Mape. Mm-hmm. People we look mm-hmm. up to. People who, you know, who have gone through things and people who have just shown the way for us younger people what it means to actually be in a marriage. And that's to, possible. You, you know, can make it, it to possible. a godly, yeah, a godly yeah. marriage. Mm. Yeah, so honestly, I mean, looking at the singles, they spoke about being successfully single and how important that is. Um, <clears throat> how important that is to be successfully single, you mm. know, clearing your field to make sure that when you do meet somebody, it's not like there's clutter everywhere. You're not mm. having to, you know, manage certain things. So that was a good um, show to start with. And then obviously Mama Tina came with her type. So black mm. man, all that kind of stuff, you know. Yeah. Chin, stop being scarred. Get over it. Grow up. <laughs> <laughs> chin, chin, grow up. To pray about chin, grow up. <laughs> chin, grow up. <laughs> yeah. And then um, we moved on to people that were in a relationship. So we had like Danny and Nigel who came on with their story and how, you know, Instagram has been like a very great tool. Um in sort of like helping their relationship come together so if you're an instagram um i wouldn't say that's the best way to find somebody because mm. personally i don't know for that one but it happens so i wouldn't say rule it out better than a dating app to be honest you're funny <laughs> <laughs> no okay. is it not anyways carry on is instagram not better than a dating app i don't know <laughs> carry on <laughs> wait no am i lying guys is instagram not better than a dating app wait so what's the what, what's the question there Anyway, okay, fine. I was just saying, didn't it? It was just by the way. Um, yeah, so then we had obviously Joseph and um, Leslie that came on. Oh mm. my goodness. Then mm. Chin came with the whole submission thing. Everybody went wild. Um, but Joseph explained it very nicely and Leslie put a very nice summary into it. So their relationship too was very good. They talk about, because they're from two different backgrounds. So knowing how to sort of like accommodate each other and learn how to be with each other so like long term anyway that's that's a very good um example as well if you're from two different backgrounds and you're in a relationship that would be a good show to catch and then um we went on to obviously trendy and Mm -hmm. sean Mm -hmm. who came in with the seriousness like honestly i had no idea that long distance relationship can be that funny i mean the banter and arguments that you have over a glitching phone call. <laughs> mm. mm-hmm. <laughs> the banter yeah. and arguments you have over a glitching phone over call. Phone. I feel like that alone. Mm-hmm. Huh? Over a phone call, you know. Over a phone Something call. Something that's meant to bond, actually. Can you imagine? Like, is, over... God, over God, 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 God's purpose was done. Amen. <laughs> so Amen. Say. So <laughs> that, that was funny. Mm. So honestly, if you are looking... They're also from two different backgrounds mm. and they have made it thus far. They are engaged, by the way. Looking forward to that wedding. <laughs> mm. I'm going to have with Jollof and Sadza. Amen. On there you get it. One plate. <laughs> Doesn't matter. Yo, some people... In this. <laughs> no, but you have the Sadza on one side. Then you have the Jollof on one side. Yeah. Okay. What's your problem? Okay. Anyway, whatever. I'm gonna have Jonathan Sad on that day. Innit? Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter what order I take it in or when I take it. In, the fact is that I'll take it in in Jesus' mm. name. So yeah, mm. that's gonna be a good. I wedding don't fear you taking it in. It's just when it comes out. That's what. That's my <laughs> biggest. You're threat. nasty, bro. You. You're actually nasty. Move, <laughs> <laughs> move. <laughs> so yeah, honestly, that was a very, very good show as well. Mm. And obviously, they spoke about how being engaged also increases the urges to be near one another, mm. and the fact that they have this long distance relationship also makes it more difficult. But by the grace of God, baptism has shut down all the booty call possibilities in <laughs> Jesus' name. A and, power um, of baptism, you know, a good baptism. Power of bapt- a good baptism <laughs> will do Jesus. that to you. So there's definitely no ever, ever in Jesus' name booty calls, no sleepovers, none of that mm. nonsense. So we thank God for that. Um, mm. That's been cancelled. Um, Interesting, you know. <laughs> oh, why didn't we show the clip of... I, I didn't lose it. I didn't lose it. It was Wait, just funny. What did you lose? What? Um, I think when I was laughing at mm. um, Colin and and Wisdom. Mm, oh, what happened? Because he said he takes her to the guitar shop and takes and tells her to record him. <laughs> yeah. And then I was, 
So, that was so, wild to me. So, it was wild. I don't know why I was so wild at that moment. So but I was it in was the wild. studio and I was, you know, I was just looking. And obviously he's passionate. And wisdom was like, yeah, he takes me there. Yeah. <laughs> I, 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 so I, I wanted to. That's, that's the, like, I, no, it's funny. It was funny. It? it was funny. Anyway, don't worry why we didn't show you that clip. Um, but Minister, please, if you want to show that clip, please show that next next time. Um, but yeah, guys, if you want to catch that um, episode about Wiz, please, it's there as well. But back to my 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 timeline mm. yeah so mm-hmm. we, we we're still on um trendy and tendy trendy and tendy trendy and sean and um yeah so basically they showed us how obviously the, the there's no more none of that stuff and they're really taking this this part of their journey very very seriously and i presume now they're actually learning how to probably like you know live with each other learn about how um, each other's time who spends time with god at what time and all that kind of stuff so i think it's really really good to catch as well if you're engaged and you want to make it a godly relationship if it's not one already mm. they will be a very very good um episode to catch mm. right chin yeah do you want to carry the next one because i feel like i've spoken better which one's the next one <laughs> after that it was I'm so, um, <laughs> I'm so deep into the jollof and the because now i'm seeing I feel about to say you're deep in spirit people are putting make, all sort of manner of combinations in this chat about jollof rice and sadza i'm looking my belly's moving i don't know if you're hearing the noise in the studio so you want jollof rice and sadza as well why would i want jollof rice and sadza why don't you want do jollof rice like and sadza? Rice and sadza? yes no, I'm, I do not. I, I don't know what you see, but I tell you I don't. So you don't, so you don't want jollof rice and salsa? The day after, no, no, it's cool. Anyone who's in the booth Okay, cool. Me, so at their wedding, away. at their wedding, yeah. you're not going to eat jollof rice and salsa? I don't know what I'm going to eat, but I need to watch because there's, there's certain food you eat. Because you don't want pals again, innit? What are you Guys, talking? who remembers that what time, yeah? Hey, stop, stop. I'll mute you. What, what, what? I don't know what's wrong. You know, Jessie has a very bad habit. She, she, forgets, she forgets you on a show, innit? So... She brings personal stuff on, isn't it? Isn't it, Jesse? Yeah? I, don't, I, I don't know what's wrong with you, isn't it? So anyway, m- moving on anyway, cool. I don't know. She lost it. Do you get me? And, and I get what minister. Bro, I don't, I don't think that's appropriate for a show, by the way. Heads up, yeah? So cool. So let's calm it down, right? Cool. So cool. You're, no, you're muted. You're muted, number cool. one. So cool. And away from that, so cool. Jess, away from people's personal stuff, right? Yeah, mm-hmm. Let's be professional. Mm-hmm. Move on. What's next? All right, cool. So then What's after next? that, mm. it was Wisdom and Colin. Mm. So they are... Um, <laughs> they're already married, though, the last um, clip that we showed. They had a very, very interesting journey where... <laughs> are you okay? I am. I am. I'm fine. So they had a very interesting journey. So Colin and Wisdom, they're like literally, what, eight years apart, I believe they said. So they... <laughs> So they expressed how um, she's tried to be young and show some of the young sides to her, to um, Colin, and he doesn't get it at all. So most of the time, why are you guys laughing? I can't. He's not here. You know what, Jess, I think what we're going to do, we're going to end this segment of the show <laughs> because we're going to, we're going to, because me, I, 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 it's been a, a I wonderful can't deal. series. So we understand the deal. excitement, right? So what we're going to do, we're going to put a filter so we're not going to bring people's personal stuff into it, yeah? Okay, so cool. away from that, guys, yeah, it's been an amazing series. It's been obviously wonderful having <laughs> every single person who's jumped on and, you know, shared their experiences. I think one of the most amazing things we need to understand is people actually went out of their way. You know, people shared some very intimate personal things. People actually exposed and showed themselves to the community. They showed themselves to their brothers and sisters, you know, irrespective of what's going on. And it's something we should never take for granted. So we just want to say as a show, as a community, as a people, every single person who's here, who's watched, every single person who's been around, every single person who's participated, your likes, you know, your views, your shares, even some of the comments. We've been walking in church and we had people say, hey, what you said, I I don't agree of it those little mm. stuff we love that stuff because it shows that we have an amazing community behind us propping this and pushing this forward so we just wanted to say a massive thank you and you know we plan by the grace of god to have greater series this was just a first pilot of our great big big kind of series we want to have more and we want every single person involved so just to say we just want to appreciate every single person who's watched and participated Thank you. So, Jess, there is an announcement you said, right? Talk to us. Okay. Right. So, <clears throat> guys, so although this is the last series um, of, or last series, not, last show of the series, mm. we have, we have a reunion. Ooh, so, ooh, ooh, we're going to have 
the reunion coming up. Flings to Rings reunion. Come Guys, on, hashtag on, on, Flings on. to Rings reunion. Hey. So the idea was actually to obviously have um, every couple that we had on together at the same time mm. and um it's going to be a live show like guys you don't want to miss this one um i will not announce the date just yet because mm. we want to keep you guys on your toes and we want to keep you guessing um but yeah that is coming up very 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 soon um if you have any ideas or any questions that you want to ask um the um, couples then please send it across and we will have that on that day on the show now that guys Honestly, the setup is going to be different. The whole atmosphere is going to be different. Everything on that show is going to be different. <laughs> Koisi said, nowhere, where can I get a ticket? <laughs> you know what? Yeah, we actually did think it would be good to have like a live audience. However, the setup, I don't think, I don't think it's going to allow that. But if we were in the new building, uh, God willing, we probably could have done it there. But no, guys, unfortunately, we can't have live audience this time. So um, you don't need a ticket. It would be online, um, so you can literally view it <laughs> like this. And yeah, that's the announcement. So Flings to Rings, the reunion coming to you live. Yeah, it's going to be amazing. So guys, better prep up. It's going to be such a beautiful thing to actually see and notice, man. You know, it's going to, it's going to be a lot of hype. There's going to be a lot to it. But also, it's just going to be a celebration for the amazing personalities who decided to jump on the show Amen. and say that, look, you know... Look, we're going to be open. We're going to be vulnerable. And we don't take that for granted. So I'm so excited for the reunion. And I know JB is. I know every single person is, right? And I think we might use that to charge some stuff for some... Uh, as Jenny, well. you always want people to sow seeds, man. No, I, did I say I said charge. That's different. Charge okay. seed is different as well. So how much are you going to charge? Bit. Anyways, it doesn't matter. So <laughs> anyway, away from all of that, guys, you know, you know, obviously this is sometimes, you know, you know, mm. it, it is a Monday and we enter that stage where is the sad part of the show and you guys knew i had to this load song. up the track this track makes me want to cry Wait, you should have got a different for flings to rings though it is what it is mate it is what it is mm. right so it's been an amazing series with every single person who's jumped on as we did say we have a grand ending a grand finale and we want every single one of you guys to grand be a part finale. of it right we're gonna give more details as time goes on but one more time just a shout out every single one of you guys who came on, those Amen. who may not have come on, <laughs> but you've commented and you've liked, and you know, there's 32 likes. And I know by the end of my speech, you're gonna finish, we're gonna fix that to like 50 something likes, right? But it's been an amazing series. We've enjoyed the journey. We had some ups, we had some downs, but most importantly, we had you guys in the studio or around us virtually, which is amazing. JB, any words you have to say? Now, honestly, yeah, like what Chin said, we wanna extend literally our love and thanks to everyone that has been a part of this series. Mm. The series definitely wouldn't have been a series without any of you guys i mean yeah i mean look at it we can't sit here and just have me and chin talking about our love lives like mm. forever that would have mm. been boring so you guys literally yeah. came in and added your you own have heard, it's a love story that's what my love life is it's a love story a tale of love oh no, yeah no, yeah, yeah. wonderful love uh-huh i don't want to release that continue yet. no 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 it's, all, <laughs> it's, not, re <laughs> it's yeah. not released yet so yeah, oh yeah i hear you mean yeah yeah yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah, so honestly, thank you guys for coming on, each and every single one of you. Thank you guys also who turned up online as well and mm. was viewing, commenting, participating, you know, cheering them on, all that kind of stuff. That was very much so appreciated. Mm. We also need that same energy for the reunion. Mm. Um, so yeah, guys, honestly, if you know the plan and the agenda for that evening, woo, mm -hmm. I'm excited. I am excited. It will be a nice mm. ending and a nice bang. Mm. Um, to the end of the series. So mm. yeah, guys, that's it from me. Mm -hmm, uh, mm -hmm. Hope you guys have a blessed week. We'll cool. be back, God willing, next week. And um, yeah. And before we actually go, we just want to give out a quick reminder. There's some two amazing shows coming up. One of them, I know the name. The other, I know the name, but my French is not necessarily good. So we're having a show hosted by the wonderful, amazing, let me not go too into it, Stephanie Adiemi called One Accord is going to be amazing. We're not giving a lot of, she's not giving a lot of details, Amen. but I just know. Word in the street I'm excited is for this. Powerful. It's I'm going excited to be moving. for this. It's going to be riveting. It's going to be amazing. I am so, excited up for that. For That's coming one. very soon. So, guys, be actually, if you guys are excited for that, literally just say, I am excited. I am excited. I am excited. Right? You know, I, I, know am I am excited. I know you, know you certainly are, right? I cool. am definitely <laughs> excited. What front and center front I and am? Center, everywhere. The I am one, excited. Now, it, it's <laughs> my French. 
this is why I'm going to be playing a lot of Duolingo before it starts, right? But it's a French show for French speakers and everyone who actually wants to get involved. Toche Francais. I'm going to get in trouble for the way I pronounced it. I am so sorry if you're watching the wonderful Dorette, so please forgive me. But mm -hmm. it's going to be an amazing show because I realize sometimes, you know, we're so engulfed with what's going on in the West when in reality things are going on in different spheres and, you know, of life. There's the whole anger. There's a, what's it? I was going to say Anglo people, but no, there's French people who actually have different ways of thinking in different ways of operating i want to know especially as we're trying to go into the world and preach the gospel so it's going to be amazing Dorette, oh yeah you did tell me i forgot it was such a long time i'm sorry but we are so excited for that show so i'm going to get on my doing hey, some people come up to learn french, french now. and it's going to be deep some people um, come up hey, french so there you see it's francophone so we're seeing there's there's a crowd for it there's people who are on it and it's going to be so amazing we we francophone just sweet <laughs> Just so all of a sudden everyone's French yeah. <laughs> my French is well there's only two languages I, I speak and everyone knows what they are three actually English what, Ibo, what? and you know the language uh -huh. my brother knows it's a heavenly language you may not know about it as well but anyway, <laughs> <laughs> so, so anyway by, the, by the way so it's been youth beat it's been an amazing show today praise the lord for what's been going on and also show your love and appreciation by liking it's been Chinonso it's been JB, JB and we are out by the grace of God God bless you guys Bye -bye. blessings guys Listening to Youth Beat. Join us the same time next week for more youth empowerment talks. On Fire Radio. Anywhere, anywhere.